President Mohamed Buhari has hosted General Overseer of the Deep Alive Bible Church, William Kumi, at the Presidential Villa in Abuja. The president at the meeting admitted that Nigeria has its challenges but insisted that he is working to overcome it. Kumi, who was accompanied by his wife Esther, urged the president to remain focused and do what is right as he continues to pray for him. We have uh, challenges in terms of uh, trying to get people to understand us, uh, but uh, uh, in spite of uh, my experiences uh, being a governor minister under General Obosanjo for three years, petroleum more than three years, and then eventually the head of state, and uh, even getting the experience of being in detention for more than three years, <laughs> so I, I think I have gone through it, and uh, having tried three times, and really the fourth time I came here uh, as a president, three times I ended up in Supreme Court. So really, I look at my country extremely hard, and try and see, as I come along this way, uh, what I have seen and so on. That's why today, maybe you may notice, maybe in the film that I am sitting by, uh, General um, um, Gawan, uh, and uh, I told him about three months ago that one of the best things he did is NYSC. Every hour or every time I went home, I get the ones that were posted to my local government, some from Fort Harcourt, some from Lagos, you know. Very interesting. I tell them, okay, this program, I love it. General Gond has done very well for our country. I said, the world did not start with Fort Harcourt or Lagos. Neither does it end with Daura, which is in the Sahel, almost in the desert, <laughs> where I live. And uh, I always call them, and some of them, they stay there and get job around in the state, can I say? some get married okay. and stay there. So uh, today I, I told him, so when the NYSC were marching past, he got up and, and took the salute. <laughs> it's, it's a fantastic program, and uh, uh, God uh, certainly knows what he's doing, more than 250 cultures to get us together, uh, we must appreciate that. We must appreciate it. You're creating the time. I wasn't expecting after such a busy day you'll see have time for a private visit like this. Just to express our appreciation of the government and uh, to say that you should remain focused and courageous. Uh, normally in leadership, we can't have everybody supporting publicly but all the same we have to be focused and uh, do what we know is right and move our country forward but be assured that we are praying for you as uh, the number one in the country uh, and we are praying that uh, your tenor will be a tenor of uh, progress and prosperity in our nation as well as peace